Hey guys, what's up? We're watching Samsung Tricks, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to install Pixel ROM in your Mi A1. So, let me show you some major changes that you will get after installing the ROM. So, the first thing that you will notice is the battery menu will be totally customized just like the Android 8.1. And the second major thing you will notice that you can change the theme of the Mi A1 by going to Display, Advanced, and you will see two options like Device Theme. You can change it to any color and you also get a second option the third major change you will notice that you will get a portrait mode in the front camera of your mia one so let me show you how you can do that so first of all you have to unlock the bootloader and install twrp for that you have to go to your system folder, then go to about phone then click on seven times on build number so that it will enable a developer mode once you have done that now you have to enter the password then hit the back button and go to developer option now there you have to scroll down and you will see OEM unlocking just enable it and to ask for password just enter your phone password and enable it. So once you have done all these things then you are good to go. Now what you have to do is make sure your phone is connected through USB and in fast boot mode. So how do you do that? So, so what you have to do is just take the USB-C and connect it to your phone. Now press the volume down button and power button at the same time to to boot your phone into the fast boot mode so once your phone is booted into the fast boot mode now connect the usb to your computer now you have to download these files from the link down below in description now you have to copy this file and paste it in your sd card so that you can use it at the time of install so you have to extract the mi a1 folder i am using winrar to extract you can use any so you have to open the mi a1 folder now open cmd now you have to write some command first write fastboot space devices now hit enter now again you have to type fastboot space oem unlock and press enter now it will be now your bootloader will be unlocked now you have to install twrp for that you have to type the command fastboot space boot space recovery dot img so see the command properly and write it properly otherwise it will break your phone so once you have done that you have successfully unlocked bootloader and installed twrp but now your phone go to the twrp mode from the fast boot like this now you have to swipe to unlock so once you have done that now you have to wipe it and just click on wipe now click on format data Click on advanced wipe now. Once it formatted, now click on advanced wipe. Now click on select the first four and just, and just swipe to wipe. Now, if you see something like red in that, you don't need to worry, it will be normal. Now click on install, find the folder where you copied. Now install the pixel experience ROM by swiping to flash. So once you have done that, it will start flashing the ROM. So it will take around 5 minutes to flash it. Now once it flashed, you can reboot it now. But if you want to install and get some extra features and if you want to reboot the ROM, then you have to install TWRP. Just like click on TWRP and swipe to flash. Then again, you have to swipe the magic just like the same. And once you have done these, you have to click on reboot then you have to click on system and you have to phone will be rebooted just you have to swipe to reboot and your phone will be rebooted your phone will be turning on you will see some google logo at time of opening now you have to it will take around two to three minutes to first start up now let me set up it first Now you can see that the fingerprint sensor is in the fingerprint is working very fine and smoothly. And once I add the fingerprint, boom, you had got the pixel in your MIA one. So that will be very less just like the stock. Let me finish it again. Oof, finish it up. So once I had done that, so let me show you the camera the major thing that you will notice so you will get a motion enable automatic you have to turn it off now you will don't have to turn on hdr manually it will be turned on automatically 
Now from the swipe left you will be able to see lens blur as well as portrait mode. Lens blur you can call it bokeh mode also but you don't get to the zoom. So just you have to sell, let me show you how the lens blur work. You have to slowly swipe up your device to drop to take the lens blur and also the lens blur also works on the front also but you can change it to the portrait mode as you want and I had taken that pic at 2 a.m. midnight and you can see the blur is just great because my even camera front camera is not that much good as you know so the blur is quite good i am using this rom for past couple of days but i hadn't found any bug yet you also notice a major thing that the rom is running on android 8.1 share this video with your friends and family who don't have that much money to buy pixel phone but want to get pixel experience in their mi one and i will hope to see you soon